Hey, welcome back everybody to another Northern Gaming Repentance Countdown 100% win Eden Streak uh, run. 35 days from Repentance, that's exactly 5 weeks away. So now's a great time to request off, make sure you got a week or two, and uh, get that time so everybody can play Repentance as soon as it comes out. Let's get into the Eden run here. Low speed. Low range, great tears, great shot speed, incredibly low damage. But we have uh, the wooden cross, blue fly, and um, it's that kidney bean, love, love bean. I don't know the beans. Nobody likes them, so why would I occupy my memory space with them? What's okay? Oh, it's it's giga bean. I know that much from that effect. Okay, well, there's a shop we can't have or use. There's a tinted rock up there, which is nice. I saw the holy mantle around me, and I was like, ooh, holy mantle. But then I saw the fly, and I was like, oh, we have wooden cross. Which is still something, but it's not holy mantle. Anyway, Giga Bean might be useful somewhere on accident. So uh, we'll keep it for now. But if there's a better space for item in the item room, we won't hesitate to take it. Get some fly damage on this guy. 2.63, when I think the minimum you can get as Eden, unaffected by any damage multipliers, of course, is um, 2.5. So it's pretty low. But at least we have a high tiers rate. If we had like 18 or 19 tiers rate, I would just be trying to use this fly all day long. And even then, I'd probably fail to use it. Alright, here's an item room. Maybe it can save us a bit. <laughs> Gosh. Alright, get me out of here. We need a bomb for that tinted rock. A couple soul hearts would be nice. Small rock, of course, would be good for damage, but it would leave us incredibly slow. So I'm hoping it's almost not small rock. But I'm hoping we do get a bomb to at least try it out. Or if it is small rock, hopefully we get the belt from the boss here. It is just basement one, but it doesn't even look like we're getting a, a bomb. So let's just see what happens. Giga Bean, actually pretty helpful right there. And, um, yeah. That's about it. Where's our fly? There it is. Can't see anything. Curse the darkness. You have to hate it. Get him. Alright, little Steven is certainly, uh, Something. We don't have any bombs. We don't have anywhere to proc this uh, holy mantle charge on like a blood bank or anything. Like curse room. No. Okay. Oh. Alright. Probably the luckiest poop I've ever seen in my entire existence. Oh, I forgot to do the seed. But you probably saw it because I think I paused it for a second. What is it? HZF00CWA. Alright. Boss trap room. Not worth it, probably. Alright, our HP has become a mystery, but we know we have one red and one blue heart. So that should be pretty easy to remember. Chariot. We could go in and out of here without taking damage now that we have the chariot. And using our uh, wooden cross. I'll think about it. We'll have to see what the rest of the run uh, turns up. Or the rest of the floor, that is. could use the bean in here just to speed this up, but they're just flies, so why give them the why give them the time of day when you just kill them? And hopefully the item room connects off this. Alright, it does. Alright, the red flies. Kind of a pain, to be honest, but we got them. And I learned these guys are called clotties? Clotties? As in, like, a blood clot, I guess? Or at least I'm pretty sure, so... Oh, that's what I'll be calling it from now on. I used to call them bone wheels, or meat wheels, but uh, it's because they look like they're made out of meat. But I guess they're made out of blood, which would explain the stain on the floor. But meat bleeds too. Alright, we need a good item. Alright, Pyromaniac, not exactly what I was looking for, but you can't really pass up explosion immunity. And the fact that bombs will heal us is also a plus, assuming we get more red hearts. But either way, explosion immunity is very nice to have. Don't have to worry about pivoting off troll bombs. Don't have to worry about mom's foot or Satan's foot. Not that we're going to see Satan. Go 
golden key and a bomb and a penny for one bomb. We could do that easily, obviously. Would have been nicer if we got that before we went in the item room, but you live and you learn. Alright, little Steven will be actually doing, I think, 3.5 damage per shot, so he's doing more than us, but firing less. So we'll see how it pans out. I think he's an asset to the team, though. So that's very good, very good. Thank you, little Steve. Get the fly in there. What's this? Hagalaz. Well, we wasted a bomb. Because we could have just done this. Alright, that's okay. Is this the... No. Okay, I thought it was the secret room. Or I placed it wrong. Uh, not sure which is more likely. Eight cents. Don't have any huge buys right now, and no particular items on uh, on the horizon. Could have spent a bomb on the keeper to maybe get a nickel. But let's take our card and go against probably Monstro or Pin. Who did we fight on the first floor? Oh, Larry Jr. So yeah, Monstro. Just basement again. We're, we got lucky there. That's the. It's about our luckiest part of the run so far. Is we got two basements. He's not going to do a mega jump because he's the gray champion or darker champion. I don't know how you classify it. Let's try to get our fly on him though. There we go. He's spitting, but that's okay. Let's see what we got for a devil deal. Hopefully something incredible. Hey, there's some damage. Speed and damage. That's perfect. Alright, we could take flying, but it would leave us at one heart. But we technically and literally only have two hearts, so... Sure, why not? Flying will likely help prevent something. We don't have any tinted rocks, but let me go back and make sure. And at this point, we're going to fly in to the secret... Or not the secret room. Curse room. And walk out. And we'll have Holy Mantle, so we shouldn't take any damage, I believe. And hopefully we gain hearts. I'm looking for like two red chests with two soul hearts each. Unlikely, I know. Alright, so far so good. Let's take these guys out. Per perfect, perfect. Thank you. Alright. Lovers. If we can find the super secret room and it's got the black heart, obviously it's a great time to use the lovers. But where could it be? I guess technically up and left of that room. And also here? Hey. Oh my god, it was the black heart room. Alright, we just quadrupled our health. And for a pretty low price. I know we're leaving chariot behind, but that's fine. I'm going to celebrate <laughs> that super secret room and head on down. That's an incredible get for us. Alright, Caves 1. We got flying and decent stats now. So nothing too much to complain about, but I'll find something, don't worry. Oh, we still got Giga Bean. What's up with that? I'm just kidding. Alright, Curse Room for half a heart. Again, I'll think about it. Actually, no, we get it for free because we have Wooden Cross. Yikes. Alright. Well, you can't win them all. And so far for Curse Rooms, we've won none of them. So, uh, I guess the saying stands, you can't win them all. Perfect. Wooden Cross would have prevented that, but it didn't, because we used it. So, was the Curse Room really free if we took damage? I don't even know. Got some keys. That's nice. Maybe we'll get a double key room full of uh, red chests or something. You know that with the, with the spikes. You know that treasury room. Yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. Alright. Large champion here. Oh gosh. Almost spit a fly in our face. But no issue. Okay, we got the red fly and the blue fly. One more and we become Beezle, we become Beezlebub and get free flying. But we already spent a red heart on flying. Why am I pressing these buttons? So it's not exactly free if we already had it, right? 
And I think we get some sort of fry. Oh, Jesus. I think we get some sort of fly friendliness as well. Uh, from. Was it, is it Beelzebub or Beelzebub? I always mix them up. Anyway. One more fly item and we become the Bee Man, as I like to call him. Lord of the Flies. Alright. Could use some more bombs now that we've blown ours blown all ours up. But you know what? I'm willing to uh I'm willing to wait on complaining about that. That's a pretty good get. We got three more item rooms. Let's try and find one cent. Should be pretty easy. Should be. Alright. Don't want to invest too much time taking one of these guys out. Another one could jump on you. You're not even realizing it. And there's our one cent. That's a key. I wanted to materialize the, uh, you know. And here's our one cent. We'll find it. We'll find it in here. Don't worry. And here's... Damn. Okay. One more. Oh my gosh. There's a lot of rooms over here. We saw the boss. Son of a biscuit. Alright, that was unfortunate. But, uh... It's alright. Super secret under here? I just wanted a penny. What the heck? Everybody dropping pills and stuff, man. Alright, it is unfortunate we got hit by that champion shot two rooms ago. But we need to go and find a penny. Because even more options would be a great boon to this run that's doing okay, but obviously could use some help. Oh my gosh. Not even sure what hit me. I know I was dodging the one fly. I must have walked into something else. I was trying to use my flies, which aren't coordinated. This is uh, it's going downhill pretty fast. So many keys. I just want a penny. I don't have a bomb anymore. Can't do that. Alright, easy room. One penny. Made out of keys. Alright, there's a golden chest next to the curse room. Let's go there. If it doesn't have a penny in it, then I don't know what to damn say after that, you know? Alright, there's a penny. Perfect. There's... What the... F there's 16 bombs in this chest. Six bombs, at least. Which is still outrageous. Magic Mush is obviously going to be here. Perfect. Uh, I think I saw somewhere else I wanted to use a bomb. Let's check real quick. Was it here? Oh, it was probably the, the double stone chest. You know what? We're going to do it. We're going to get uh, Cricket's Head. Hey, we got a Soul Heart. And that's the most important thing. Assuming we don't lose a whole Soul Heart doing this, then it's definitely worth it. Get out of here. I like to pre-fire, but sometimes I forget to kill the last enemy of the last round, so that kind of helps. Or else you're pre-firing at nothing. And even if you don't know where they're going to be, because you're not sure what wave it's going to be, there's usually one at the top and, you know, one at the sides, etc. So you know where to pre-fire, let's be honest. And, uh, useless trinket. But hey, we got the soul heart. We're going to head to the shop. And it'd be nice now if we got, I'll just say it, one more penny for a soul heart, but we uh, we don't have that luxury. We could have taken it, but let's just go on with uh, our three hearts. Okay, Fallen's an interesting uh, boss here. Guaranteed double deal item drop, but will it be a uh, sacrificial altar? Because I'll take these flies out in a minute, you know what I'm saying? Or will it be, uh, Brimstone Black Powder, Mom's Knife, The Pact? I'll just name, oh my god, I walked into a goddamn fire. For Brother Bobby, we walked into a fire. Well, I think we're two-thirds, uh, conjoined as well now. At least we got the scent there. So we're two-thirds Beals above, and two-thirds conjoined. Some would say it's not their favorite, uh, transformations. 
and some would say conjoined is in fact a damage down because it is but you know what maybe we like damage downs and I didn't even use my bean because I forgot we had it that's okay could come back for that Let's use our bean in the next room, just so we say it was useful during this run. Oh my god. Oh, I'm surprised we didn't get hit, but I'm also delighted we didn't get hit. Alright, shop or library? <gasps> A library. Alright, let's get bookworm, and let's walk away with Book of Sin. We got uh, a great use out of uh, Giga Bean the room before, so I don't feel guilty. And you know what, this this room was pretty close to the starting, so that's why I was like, wait a minute, is it a library? And then it was. So I was uh, very happy to go in there and find five books. Book of Sin probably has like a 50% chance to pay out with like a soul heart. Or black heart. So that'll be nice, I hope, for our health. And anything else I can do is nice too. Maybe some pennies, maybe some... That's about it, actually. Hearts and pennies is fine. Alright. Let's get some more deal chance and a ton of spiders. Alright, let's look for the item room. We got a choice now, thanks to even more options. There might even be a reroll machine. So, we could be really rolling through some items we don't like. Okay, here it is. We just gotta get through this hellscape of a room first. Oh my god. Alright, giant, giant worm. Get out of here. Oh, and there's the shop. Okay. All right, just stand, and he can't hurt you if you stand still. Perfect. You son of a... All right. Well, we have Pyromaniac, so... Bomber Boy's not a bad pickup. And we could buy the heart, or we could re-roll and look for something else. I'll take the heart, that's fine. Book of Sin not helping us out just yet, but I know it's about to. But just in case we get a deal, we want at least four soul hearts. So we can take something in case it's incredible. Or take something else that just gives us hearts back, obviously. Get out of here. Lots of, lots of spiders in this room. But hey, I was built for... Spiders. That doesn't make sense. Alright, let's just go. Hopefully these two blow each other up. No, get back here. Get back here. There we go. Alright. Alright, slow room. Sorry about that. Hey, we got a key and a bomb, though. Which are not soul hearts. I said 50% chance. Which is a rough estimate true. But, you know what? I thought the book would listen and try to act like it uh, was going to be that percent. Well, we got hit there, but that was our first hit for the floor. So that was Wooden Cross. So we didn't take damage, which was nice. So, what's with, what's with all the pills? Alright, if we lay this right between them, we get both fires. Oh, I forgot we got Bomber Boy. So we get both fires pretty much no matter what. And that's beautiful to see. What the? Where's the boss? It's this flooded cave, man. They're all like, oh, here's flooded caves. It's 20 rooms longer than regular caves. And you're like, okay, great. It's flooded caves, right? Yeah, that's what it's called. Flooded caves 2. Which is fine, because we got two basement floors. But this is a slow run. I'll just say it. It's nice we got a damage up, but 4.3 damage is not going to last us much longer. Nice. Uh, more black hearts appear, right? Oh my, what the hell was that movement, dude? You were getting shot, so you moved to the right. And you were getting shot from underneath. Get the hell out of here. Great. Alright, well. At least we got lucky on the blue fires, because I got damaged uh, a lot the other time anyway. Alright. Big bomb, big fly damage. We're not going to let Gertie get out of here with a single hit on us. There's double fly. Look at that. Alright, another soul heart. Some keys. Almost went in the damn door just for shooting the poops. 
Ooh, guppy. Nine lives. Could do that, could do that, no problem. Uh, sure. Alright, one third guppy, two thirds something else. Don't need any more keys, so that was pointless to be gold. In fact, it's a downside, because then we don't carry a physical key down with, the, with us. So. But anyway. Nine lives, obviously. Gives us a couple resurrections at some point. Hopefully we don't need to use them. But I took it just in case, because I figure, you know what, we are going to get more soul hearts from Book of Sin. Uh, maybe. So, uh, I figure, let's trade some away for a red heart. And resurrections. Get out of here. I'm not going to say we're going to become guppy, because we haven't in, like, 50 runs, it feels like. So, I'm sure we'll just get two-thirds guppy, and then die a lonely, cold death. Alright. Use our spectral shots from Spirit of the Night. Tin and rocks in here. I don't think so. There we go. Try to get some damage in on these guys before this one explodes. Bookworm, obviously helping every once in a while. That's what it does. It's basically the definition. Oh, that was the fly champion. I always get him confused with the explosive shot champion. Pretty similar shades of like blue purple. Anyway. Item room here. We get another choice. Let's see what we get here. Spectral, which we already have. And Revenge Fly, which gives us Beelzebub. So I think black flies are friendly to us now or something? I don't know. And we'll use Spectral to not break the poops here. Or Brother Bobby will break them anyway. Honestly, we could just stand here with the flies and do it. But uh, we broke everything now, so there's no going back. How much health do you have, buddy? Alright, that's what I thought. Alright, car battery would be great to get. So that time we get batteries from uh, Book of Sin, it means we get two more tries. Which could mean more batteries, which could mean two more tries. You see how that goes. Anyway, walked into the enemy there for no reason. But, Wooden Cross saved our damage. From being damaged on our health. You know what I mean. Alright, we gotta get behind this guy, or have him just stop on a wall, or a hole. Perfect. There we go. Alright, so obviously, not too much repentance news this episode, but the blog post will be in a couple days, so that'll be nice. Maybe they'll reveal some more details about the mines, or the secret boss, now that it's only five weeks away. I say secret boss, but I'm pretty sure I mean the witness, and whatever it's been renamed to and reworked to. It's probably got super armor, but you know what? That's okay, because Delirium uh, has super armor too, and everybody loves killing Delirium. Alright, that might have been sarcastic. What am I looking for? I guess we're looking for the shop. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's stay over here. They can't pop up under us if we're literally on the hole. But they're... <laughs> Never mind. I moved off the hole for one second, and there he was. What can I say? He, he outplayed me. Or maybe he's just uh, coded terribly, considering when I was over the hole, that both of them popped up right next to me. And then the second I moved, the other one popped up right under me. So Maybe uh, maybe that's a terrible enemy that I hate. It definitely is. Alright, greed in here to p piss us off. No, okay, cool. Alright, we don't need Humbling Bundle. It's nice, obviously. But we got plenty of bombs and, and whatever. Alright, we can't afford two items, so Soul Heart's fine. Let's get one incredible item. Car battery. Not Hive Mind. BFF would be fine, since we got all these jerks. Nightlight's fine, but not right now. Steam Sale, probably too late. Bastards. I don't even like... I don't even like the habit, but I guess it works. So every once in a while, or when we get hit, we'll get a charge, and maybe every once in a while it'll help towards a heart. I don't even like habit, though. I rarely ever take it. That's all I'm going to say. Alright, let's go fight sisters. Gosh. 
Okay, we have pretty low damage. Revenge Fly is going to do a lot of damage now for this room, which is nice. And uh, we got a penny because we got hit twice. So thanks, uh, Habit. That's great. Really worth it. Oh my god. Alright, we could have really used a deal there, but we got a size down and a speed up and a pill. Caffeine pill. Those are the three things it does. Alright. Curse the Lost, which is terrible. We gotta find our item room. Hopefully, the even more options pans out. Um, I think Revenge Fly was the... Oh gosh. This would be nice for money. Hopefully our shop is a shop. Uh, what was I saying? I think Revenge Fly was the secondary item added by there's more options or whatever. So I think it panned out for that. But when we took uh, Bomber Boy Bombs, that was the regular item room. That's what it was going to be anyway. So let's see if this gold item room pays out with... Really? Let's see if it pays out with a good item on the right, because that would be the new item that we made spawn with our pickup from the shop. Alright, holy shit. We have so few hearts we can't even pick up five golden hearts. Now let's blow up this guy for fun. Perfect. Alright. So it's a bit of a slower run, which is unfortunate. But uh, actually, you know what? I thought I was going to hit the blue fires. We got plenty of bombs. Didn't kill anybody. What did I get from what you call? Nothing. Usually I get tons of soul hearts from Book of Sin, and right now we're getting... I think we got one out of like... Seven uses? Eight uses? Might be worth it, but a boss room would take so long. Is Mega Fatty in the boss rush challenge room for depths? I think so. Is this depths? Dank depths. Of course it is. There's water on the walls. So that means it's dank. Bro. Alright. Curse of the Lost. Unfortunate. Now to speed up the room. Still got Wooden Cross, and I believe we still have the charge for the floor, because we haven't used it yet. Or been hit, that is, of course. Let's look for a Tinted Rock while we berate Chubb here. I don't see one, so I'm pretty upset. We do have the nine lives. But at this point, it could just turn into nine one-heart attempts on some boss, where if we take one damage, we fail. And it would just be a sob story at that point. But hey, you know what? Sometimes you have to tell your story. And it's sad. Alright, running out of interesting things to say, and that's been always a tough part for me on easy runs. And this is a tough run. Because it'll be 30 minutes before we kill Mom. So, yeah. Oh my gosh. Alright. Well, I didn't realize two worms came out of that one, so we took our hit of damage there, even though three minutes ago when we started this room, uh, we had it, and that's when I mentioned it. So, sorry that time passes, because that's when things change. Get the hell out of here. Alright. Worm. Worth it. A battery. Great. A pill we will never take. Oh my god. Where is the shop and or item room? You know what I'm saying? Alright, don't jump and, and we'll all be friend. You bastard, you jumped. Alright, no more friend. No more pills. I feel like we've already been in this room, but apparently not somehow. I just feel like our path like took us over this way already. Maybe to the right of here we've already been in, and it's like a big circle. Made of squares. Perfect. Yes. Okay. I think... I don't know where we're at. Curse the Lost has me bamboozled. Usually it's not that bad. But it's pretty bad, and so are these ghosts. Here we go. We've killed five of them, so that's pretty nice. What? Whatever. Perfect. Another battery great. The starting room. 
Where is everything? Where is everyone? Look, I don't know where the shop is, but at this point I can guarantee you it's greed. Look at all the cash we're getting. Or, it's a non-rerollable shop, and the one 15 cent item is, you know, moving box or something. Moving box is great, sure. I don't know how to use it. So, I don't like it. I know how it works, I just don't know how to take advantage of it. What the hell's going on? Get out of here. Alright. Here's where some good stuff starts. Right in here. Oh my god. Are we going to reroll the entire run? You know what? We just might. Let's find the other interesting rooms first, though, which apparently are over here. No. Where are the rooms? This way? Alright. They're probably this way. Okay. Keep in mind, if we rerolled, we'd keep Wooden Cross. But we still lose the proc already for the floor, obviously. What kind of double back shit was that? Seriously. The heck? Alright, here's both special rooms. Not the boss room, so I don't know where that is at all. Or I do completely know where it is, but I couldn't tell you. Alright, Daddy Long Legs is a great item. Shield of Tears. Probably not our best pick. And there's Greed, as I already mentioned. Alright, so we're not getting car battery. Or, uh... BFF. Or anything at all, really. Steam sale. Which doesn't matter, as well. I mean, we could obviously re-roll, but... What if we re-roll into crazy... Uh, junk? Not that this, I mean, we have a, one damage up and a bunch of familiars. Alright, is one the one that does the D4 too, or is it the six that does the D4? No, the one does everything, I think. But Daddy Long Legs is nice. But, um... If we get two other choices in the item room, maybe that'll be better for us. Let's do it. Alright, we lost a lot of stuff and got conjoined. Oh my... Alright. Okay. We got the ladder. Tech Zero. Is that the Halo? I can't even tell. We still have nine lives. Obviously Dr. Fetus. And, um... Okay, I think we just fired our shots too quickly. We don't have, uh... We don't have the, what you call? Returning tears. We have conjoined... Dr. Fetus, and we lost our... Explosion immunity, which would have been amazing. But now it sucks. No, I mean, it doesn't suck, but it... It's not as good. Let's get the... Where the hell does this room come from? What? I thought I was going to the item room. I don't know how we got here. Or at least you know where the boss is. Some, sometimes. I'm going to walk into that on the way back. Guarantee it. Is this the big room? No. Is this the big room? Oh my god. Is this the... Here's the big room. Alright. Let's go back to the item room. Let's see if it re-rolled. If not, we're taking Daddy Long Legs. If it does re-roll, we take... Alright, it doesn't matter. Alright, Daddy Long Legs is nice. We have high damage, maybe, output. 3.6 damage, but it's 3 bombs all at the same time. Because Conjoin lowered our damage. And Dr. Fetus gave us worse tears. Oh, we got Experimental Treatment, too. I didn't see that till just now. Rotten Baby, not too helpful at this point. If we could have kept Book of Sin, that would have been great. Oh yeah, we can fly. We might as well pay this guy off, then. Because there was no damn shop. Alright, so the D1 room is just your character in the D6 room must be all the all the rooms because it does like the D4 floor effect and everything I always forget which is which I always consider them both just a full personal reroll that I don't use too often but as you can see here sometimes rerolling just pays off actually with 3.63 damage we might have gotten a damage up from Experimental treatment. 
Oh my fucking god. Alright, we're gonna... Okay, these are actually... It's two of the same pills. Perks is nice. Luck up, we'll take. We're gonna need it. Sun is so nice though, we might need the heal, to be honest. Let's just go and see what the hell happens. Alright, that was pretty low. Alright. Oh, we got the attraction tiers. Oh my fucking god. Alright. Well, hopefully we find another reroll down in the womb. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Try not to tilt. Try not to tilt. Alright, we did it. For some reason we didn't get a deal. I'm pretty upset. But let's go to the womb. And we need to get to the boss as soon as possible and lose no health. So, I'm going to use the sun card. Not in here. Right, Bookworm gave us uh, an extra bomb. Okay, so we can set bombs and run away. Because they'll attract enemies due to magnetizing tears. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, put them up there. Perfect. I guess we can check the poops. There's a chance we get a soul heart, but it's pretty low, obviously. Don't need to do the one in the middle. Alright, pin. Oh my god. He went crazy, because the magnetizing bombs, but he only hit us once, and we still have wooden cross, as I said. So, uh... There we go. Get the gurgling. Where's he gonna be? Down there. Very dangerous run. Oh my. F Two troll bombs. Everything kind of combines to be pretty dangerous for us on the reroll. Um, it's unfortunate we went from crap to bad things. The other stuff we had before wasn't that bad. Um, but it was crap. But hopefully Daddy Long Legs shields us uh, by killing all our enemies wholesale. Alright. That would have been on us if we got hit. It wasn't it wasn't up to the items we had. So we didn't get hit. So that's nice. And we got a uh, Tinder Rock, which is great. I didn't know where it was, but we're blowing up the entire room pretty much every time. So we're actually up two hearts for the floor. It's pretty nice. What is this? Oh, we've already been there. Okay. Alright. We're going to take it slow. And I know what you're saying, it's already pretty slow. Hey, guess what? You're right. Sorry about that. Okay? I can't pick all the seeds. Or else I would have not picked this one. You know what I'm saying? Alright, but we got... We don't need booger tears. Not even sure that would work with the bombs. Since they explode. Okay. Secret room? There we go. That was a complete guess. Hey, 99 keys in exchange for one key, which is actually none because we have golden keys. Sure. Alright, let's go down and look for Matriarch or whoever. Probably double Matriarch at this point, considering our luck. Alright, and Daddy's long leg, Daddy Long Legs basically goes after the closest person in the room, so we don't have to worry about them being in the way for bombs, which is nice. Two of hearts. Alright. Conquest is fine. Alright, we're... S I feel slow. I don't know how we're 1.36. I feel really slow. Range up, honestly, might be the better pick here. And Krampus. Incredible. We wait all day for uh, another deal and it's Krampus. At least it's Lump of Coal. We are going to take the range up. And hopefully that scales with the bomb's uh, damage. Or makes the bomb damage scale. Alright, still a rough run. Uh, but we're trying. we got another chance at one more deal. Unlikely to happen. So just... Alright, and it, oh, jeez, he's still alive? Alright, well, we ate our wooden cross hit, and then we got hit, because uh, I thought the other guy was dead. 
So that's my bad. Oh my god. Alright. Rough run. A little bit. I mean, I can't even ask anything out of all those. It would take too long to even try. Cool. Anything back there? No. Alright. Tinted rock, not that I can see. Secret room check. Hey, okay. Alright, we get the extra deal percent. 36.25, four polycephalus. Alright, and a partridge in a pear tree. Just kidding. Alright, polycephalus. Come on out. There we go. Alright, tinted rock. No. No, no, no. Okay. Blue spiders. Alright. That was easy. Okay, two thirds guppy, because you keep your um, transformation statistics through a reroll. That's why we got conjoined immediately when we rerolled and got a uh, rotten baby. So that's nice. Some would say. Alright, we'll stock up on flies. Hope for a deal and a guppy item. Here we are. What's this? We know it, right? Perks. Perks is nice. I guess we'll use it for the fight and then come back and get the sun. Does that make sense? Perks, we only take half a heart per uh, hit. Even if we're in the womb or wherever. Even if we blow ourselves up. So that's nice. Please heat seek. Oh my god. Alright, well we took two hits, but only a full heart of damage. No deal, of course. But uh, let's take the sun and get the heck out of here. Alright, the blue fires. Hopefully, there's some blue fires on the cathedral. And hopefully, they pay out with some soul hearts. Or else we're pretty boned. Uh, this reroll was dangerous beyond belief. How many bombs are going to be in this room at once? Get out of here. Alright, what is this? Hero font? Hanged man. Worthless. Worthless. Alright, no blue fires yet, of course. Don't know what that is, and too scared to check. I don't know why I'm bombing one pot. Doesn't really matter, does it? Oh, this could be so nice. It could be so nice. Um, I guess we'll do it. Hey, we get a soul heart from uh, Larry Jr. at least. That's good. Hopefully we don't lose it immediately on Chubb. There we go. Alright, and Loki, I think, is the last one. Oh my god, it's Monstro. Alright, we lost our wooden cross hit. That's because I followed a bomb throughout the whole room. But we got some items here. Oh, we got a lot of items. Uh, sack of sacks is certainly something. Is Tammy's head gonna. Yikes. Alright. Uh, hopefully we don't take damage in there. And Bob's rotten head will just take. In case we become Bob. Go. Alright. Perfect. Uh, okay, nothing here. Did we find the secret? No secret room yet. Let's check. Let's check around. Okay. There's some blue fires. Perfect. Perfect. Not a, not a single blue heart, soul heart, spirit heart, whatever you want to call them. God, we got lots of flies though, so that's nice. There's a luck up. That might help in the chest to get more chests, and at this point I'll take it. There's another double key room. Could be another dice room. We could reroll into Guppy, or anything else, or it could be crap. D4 rerolls pedestals, we could reroll Bob's Rotten Head. Let's go back and see what it turned into. Could be Abel. Could be Cricket's Head. Does it default to the gold chest? Oh god. I stood in the middle. I was like, you know what? Gimpy? Hey, that's great. Balatar? Also amazing. What did we put down that wasn't 
Bob's rotten head. I forget. But that's fine. We took Infamy and Sack of Oh, Tammy's head. Right. Yeah, we had four items from those four gold chests. That was amazing, actually. Alright. Easy. Breezy. Beautiful cover girl. Alright, there we go. Alright. Terrible. Eh. At least it didn't hurt us. Chariot or the sun? Okay, if we use sun on the chest, it's nice. Oh, get out of here. Thank you. Use chariot for an emergency on Isaac or this room. Die! Why aren't they dying? Perfect. Why did I come in here? Oh no. Okay. No tinted rock. No nothing. Alright. Where's Isaac? Alright, we're getting lots of batteries for some reason, but you know what? That, that's fine. Death? The quarter? Oh no. Alright. We got hit once. That's okay. We should have saved the D4 room. Because we knew the quarter would be popping up. Nobody knew the, the, the damn quarter was coming. Holy crap. Alright. Let's, uh... Try this. Holy crap. Alright. So the magnetism helps against stationary bosses. Oh god, until he becomes non-stationary. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Yeah, he's just gonna get sucked in and out of the... Alright, Infamy saved us a shot there. That's great. Isaac, stay in your corner. And we can use the chariot for the rest, maybe? There you go. Alright. Got a sack. Golden bombs. Not exactly what we need right now. Uh, we're going back for the sun, which is left and up. Alright, I think we might pull this out. Now, I finally feel that we might win, and it's only now that I'm feeling that. We got one free hit, because we still have Wooden Cross. Next floor, we'll have a map, unless it's Curse of the Lost. And we should be getting some items. We'll take that in case we get money equals power. Not that damage is lacking, it's just that we keep blowing ourselves up. Alright, what do we got? HP. Okay. Uh-oh. Alright. Well, we're not going to be using Little Monstro because we're not going to be holding down the fire button long enough for it to uh, work out. But guess what? We got the finger, too. Mr. Mega might get us killed. I guess we'll pick him up. And we'll take up his head. Or should we take the card thing? I don't know. Let's go in here and use the sun card. Oh. Blue Baby's pretty close. That's pretty nice, actually. Alright, the Mr. Mega does more damage, does a bigger radius, so that's great. If we don't want to hurt ourselves, uh, we shouldn't stand in the bigger radius. That's the only uh, strategy I have. I just took my wooden cross hit and an infamy hit, so... No more hits this room. But when he throws a spider right at you, it's really tough. Alright, I think we got this. That was great. Great play. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. That room sucked. Alright, three more rooms until Blue Baby. No champion here, so that's not too bad. Closer, closer. There we go. Alright, we're doing it. Wrath. I introduce you to... Never mind, you're dead. Uh, no thanks. Little Dangle, Dingle, Dungle. I don't know what all the names are. Red Dingle. Alright. Check for a secret room or something. Almost walked into a red poop. Nope. Okay, well, we're going. And I think we're going to have this one in the bag. It was touch and go for a bit there. But we didn't take too much damage on the womb, which was nice. Um... And if we did, we found a couple hearts to replace it. So, not a great reroll, but we made it work. And honestly, the other run might have lost it, because we didn't have that much health. Because we got PJs in the reroll, so that was nice to get the four soul hearts. But hey, we pulled out another win. That's 22, I think. 35 days until repentance. I'm excited. You should be too. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being with me through this whole slog. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this episode, please. 
and uh, tune in for tomorrow's. Hopefully it's a bit better of a seed and hopefully maybe some repentance news from Ed on Twitter. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. Uh, like I said, please tune in tomorrow and until then, have a good day.